Hi everyone uh, and hello Swami. Uh, you have asked a question uh, like I have a date format for example you have a date like this uh, 5th, uh, sorry 4th of May 2011 and you would like to convert this to a format of uh, something like this right and uh, just press control 1 change it to ddd dmmm like that okay and you do this often so you're asking is there a simple way that i can do this by clicking a button in the quick access toolbar or something like that of course there is a simple way and i'm going to show you how you can use a very very simple just one line macro to get this done so for that i'm just going to get rid of this and i will start macro recorder and we will just uh, name this macro as uh, format date okay and you can assign it a shortcut key for example you can assign it a key like uh, you know uh, control shift uh, yes, or something like that but for the time being we'll just put the macro there and click ok what we are going to do is select that cell and press control 1 go to custom and type the format code now okay and then press ok now our date is formatted and I'm going to stop the macro. Let us go to view code. I'm going to resize this so it all fits inside. Uh, it's and I have a visitor in the recording room. My son is here. So say hello to him. And let me just uh, excuse me because I was trying to you know, keep this as simple as uh, uh, possible. And, so we have a format date macro and all it does is uh, you know range b4 dot select and then selection dot number format is that of course we could just get rid of that and whatever cell is selected whenever you run this macro format date it will just uh, format that to that okay so now go back here and we'll insert a couple more dates uh, in fact i'm just going to drag this date so it kind of increases so we have five more dates here and then I just select all of them and uh, go to view macros and then I'm going to run this macro. That's it. Instantly all the dates got formatted. Now this requires that the current workbook wherever you are, book three now, needs to have that macro on. But sometimes uh, you may want to just write the macro, keep it in your personal.macros workbook and then use it anywhere. That is also possible you can just uh, take that macro code that one line code and add it to your personal macros workbook and add it as an inst uh, add in to excel so that way it is available to you all the time you could even add it the whole conversion thing as a button to the quick access toolbar let me very quickly show this to you please note that i am using excel 2010 so certain menus and options might be different in excel 2003 or 2007 which are you may be using and i'm going to go to quick access toolbar here and then say macros so now we have two macros i'm just going to select the format date macro and add it so it gets added to the quick access toolbar as this button format date and press ok so now we have uh this button and all i had to do was you know we'll just uh, go through here and just change the format to short date select the dates and click this button instantly it formats right so this is how you can add a macro to the quick access toolbar as well as uh, write a simple one line macro that would convert the dates so i hope this helps you thank you very much for your time Bye bye